Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel and in this video I'm going to take you along everything I'm going to learn how to do to throw a picnic. This is my first time ever having really a picnic and it's going to be a little Mother's Day picnic with my mom and yeah so let's get right into this video. So first I just want to show you my notion board. So right here I have my notion board that I just started making and right here I labeled it picnic with a little cute icon. I thought that was super cute. And so for this notion page I titled it of course picnic and I made this task list page um, so I can put what I need to do, what I'll be doing, and what I need to get done. It's basically what I need to do. Tonight I'm going to be washing the silverware um, that came with the picnic baskets to make sure that's all clean and then these other things are basically just food that I should probably keep in mind food and drinks to keep in mind for the picnic that we might want to pick up and underneath it I just kind of annotated a little bit to give myself an idea of what we could do it may not absolutely turn out this way but it's just some ideas in case we're like hey what do we need to buy so the first one we have is bread so I see a lot of baguettes croissants then we need to get maybe some dessert and then here we have cupcakes cheesecake dark chocolate I've seen that as inspiration right here we have meat so right now we just have turkey i don't really eat like a lot of deli meats like i wouldn't know so i'd probably let my mom choose that but in case we want some kind of meat you know yeah there's there and then right here is basically just cheese and then we also need to get some fruit and then for drinks water any kind of sparkling drink or lemonade orange juice and so there's something that i'm really currently doing technically i'm about to be washing the silverware. Um, I've already unpacked my picnic basket, kind of, sorta. And then the things I've already done here, I we've brought the picnic baskets finally, and we've kind of sort of picked a location. We're gonna do it in like Richmond, Virginia, one of those kind of parks, hopefully. So these are some things that you probably wanna think about before having your picnic, and yeah. So let's get right into my first task, which is washing the silverware. So here's the picnic basket. We have our little forks and spoons and yeah, knives right there. I've already taken out the plates as you can see. And right here we just have some napkins and down here is the blanket, it's actually pretty big. And in these boxes we have the little wine glasses and so I need to wash those as well. And then we also decided to get a second little picnic basket, it's smaller than we thought it would be but it's gonna just be for like snacks or something for extra storage space. So basically, this is our setup. also have this bottle opener I guess it's for like wine or whatever so I don't know if, if I necessarily need to open this yet because like I don't know I'm underage and I need to ride home so <laughs> I may not watch this yet put all the utensils in here in your arms as it's gone by it's easy as Okay, so I'm back the next day. It is Saturday, April 30th, and now I'm just gonna have to pack up the picnic basket, and then we're basically gonna see what we can bring. Basically just going to have to pack up the silverware and take that out and pack it back up in my picnic basket. And then I also need to pick out a little picnic outfit as well. Let me check the weather. Mostly cloudy. After 12, it's gonna be in the high 60s. Yeah, let's get right into that part. Okay, so these are basically the outfits that I could kind of wear. So I could wear this white under my, this like white shirt under this purple shirt, or I could use these camo pants and wear it with this kind of white 
top shirt. I have this skirt, pink skirt with a pink shirt. And then the last thing would just be this classic like flower floral kind of dress kind of vibe. Okay, so I was thinking about wearing this outfit, little skirt and a pink like shirt. So I'm probably going to switch this out for maybe the purple top I had with some pants um, and just some white shoes basically. So yeah, and then I may wear this the next day that we're there as just a walk around because it's supposed to be more hot. So you packed, little boom box, more bags with games and stuff. Uh, pretty full, a lot of bags, but yeah, so now we're going to either make some food and start packing up the picnic bag after that really, really long time. Hello again. And if you're wondering why I changed tops, me too. But no, apparently it's not going to be as, as cold. So I changed this and the other shirt was just giving me issues. So yeah, but now we're just going to make some sandwiches. Got the bread. I got the meat, the cheese, and the mayonnaise, and I'm going to try to make it look fancy. Yeah, I'll show you the end result. Okay, so I'm finally finished with kind of making the food. Just made some regular turkey sandwiches with cheese and mayonnaise and stuff like that. Then I just cut it, cut the crust off it, and then cut it into four pieces so it makes it look like it's finger food. So I'm just putting this in these containers. Stories of life in a perfect place where I want to stay. So now I got the glasses in, they're pretty secure. So now I can actually start putting in the food, I would think. Okay, so change of plan. I took the blueberry muffins out, put in the smaller basket, and then put all like the rest of the little snacks in here and put all the packaged stuff. In that big basket. Ducks. <laughs> Alright, we're here. So we'll just get our little kit bags and we'll walk on over there to the quiet spot. Yeah. Hopefully that dog ain't poop over there. We're Let's get closer to the roadside. Yeah. Near like the flowers up there. This is our little mommy daughter getaway picnic. And <laughs> this is Diamond's first time coming to this park. Oh, little, you know, we're trying to have a little quiet, a little picnic. That's, all we're just That's a big goal, ain't it? <laughs> right, so we're here. We're having our mother-daughter picnic. It's my first time bringing my daughter here. Um, and she's never been here, so it's kind of special. Mm -hmm. So we just got set up. Took a little while. Took three hours to get here, but we're all set up. So what's that? And we have some grapes. We don't eat much, so we got some cheese, and cracker tray, and turkey. So we have some snacks there. I couldn't find my my, my charcuterie board. Look at the charcuterie board, but there's not at this. These are the cupcakes I won at the cakewalk, <laughs> and then we got the blueberry muffins from earlier. And we have some sandwiches in there. Oh yeah, I made some sandwiches, so I get to show that. We got some all these different snacks. Oh, and then we got some some pretzel thingies with chocolate on it and then we got this non-alcoholic non-alcoholic rosé rosé yeah that's um, fancy and what and do we got we here we have some grapes and bread because it's a thing to do yeah we have some hummus in there 
Yeah. Oh yeah, we got some hummus. This is everything bagel. And then the good smelling. Yeah, gotta have chicken. I don't care what the occasion is. You gotta have chicken, but it's real tissery or either baked chicken, and it smells really, really good. So Don't we're, it? Mm -hmm. Kind of hungry. Okay. So we're gonna get ready to eat, and we have some things to do later. We have some books. I'm gonna read about oh. Will and find out about his life and how controversial. Uh, no, he's a great person. <laughs> and then we have some books that Diamond's gonna read, maybe. Mm. And we have some games. We have some checkers and dominoes. And, and I got the boom box. Packing up. Look really nice though. Yeah. See, the light came back up again. Yeah, so now you want to play some games? Which one you want to play? You want to play checkers? You want to play tic tac toe? Okay. Yeah, we got these books. I don't know if we're going to read them. There's people skiing out there. That is peak 80s culture. What decade are these folks living in? <laughs> what? Sardines and pork and beans. Oh, sorry. Pork and beans. Who said eat sardines with pork and beans? Uh huh. I can feel love from miles away. There's been stories of life in a more perfect place where I wanna stay. It's easier to love when it's you by my side. Shining through the cracks like the first morning light. Feeling that it's happier to love. Oh, oh. Uh, let me replay the moment actually so she was there she was there and we won't gonna go off of it so i was like yo and then i won and so i got everything i let her win because that's the right she thing did to not do. i had two kings and a lot more you only had one king left it was destined for me to win <laughs> I think I've fallen for you And I don't know why I don't know why You love the summer rain In mid-July Mid-July My last name fits you better When I'm with you there's no pressure I miss your worn-out sweaters Weather couldn't compromise our love 